Hi, it's Thursday, Thursday. This is Misa Mohamedina, Grand Duchess, Rasmus Kunin, HBD, G4G. How are you doing? Also known as Ryan Thomas of the Mindy World Name. Uh, how are you? It's Thursday, Thursday. I have the best poem and best commentary to bring to you. Today, as I always said when I am wet and moist, I say, My butt passas is wet. My breast is tender yet. Still God loves me. I'm a woman of substance girl. And it's brought to you today by none other by... <laughs> Dr. Pepper. <laughs> Dr. Pepper. <laughs> girl. Girl. <laughs> Dr. Pepper. Have your Dr. Pepper today. Mm. <laughs> so very good, that Dr. Pepper. Don't you just love it? <laughs> that slurpy richness of Dr. Pepper. I'll read you my, I call it Like It or Not. Wrote this some time ago, girls. Thursday, Thursday is just right before Friday where you could have that nice little gulp, that little one night stand, or a one night stand that may develop into something more. That romantic touch, a lush, a touch on the breast, a kiss on the lips, just anything to give you just a little <laughs> more energy and more life and the joie de vie that God gave us to live. Mwah. I call this one, like it or not. Like it or not, will you touch it? I love him so I wanted to touch these tattoos. If anybody know him and he's single, please tell him to call me 301-214-5591. I'd love to date him. Love to date him. Okay? Now let's read it. Like it or not, I did it for the peace. But for the words themselves, like it or not, like it could not like it or not, I could not supply a number to take him blind. Like it or not, I craved an email, I carved an email, and something he did, he give me not. Like it or not, I sit here waiting for your true hand to take shape. Like it or not, he came and spit up the game. No shame. Mm. What a lovely day. Like it or not, he has a wedding ring. Oh, really? He said, it means nothing, just fits on a finger pin, like it or not. Will you come true, or I'm being sucked for my lyrics to you? Like it or not, be brave, or are you a mute to words I can hear, and a slurply I drink all day? Yes, yes, Thursday, Thursday. Little, little bit of charm, little bit, not too much tonight, you know. But I got some commentary for you, darling. <laughs> this is Washington commentary. <laughs> Going through the marriage lives and the loves and the soap operas called the White House. <laughs> Here we have proud grandparents. <laughs> Axis of Evil and Laura Bush. <laughs> Oh, look at Axis and Laura Bush. Who likes sex in this um, game? Look at himself, baby. <laughs> what if <laughs> there is a certain saying going around town? <laughs> the bushes. About the bushes. Mm -hmm. Look at them well. What a standard family picture. You know, um, remember George used to be the cheerleader. <laughs> he had a little accident. <laughs> Do you like George? No, call Laura. <laughs> Good old George. Which is now called Laura. <laughs> That's why we can't find the military records. <laughs> Good old trick. <laughs> J. Edgar Uva was a mastermind of plan <laughs> for the quirks. <laughs> in these political families. <laughs> and who may this be then? <laughs> this is actually Millie Bush. Millie Bush's son. Not Barbara. Because <laughs> this is Barbara Bush's son. <laughs> uh, and who could he be? 
none other but Pierce. <laughs> that good old old fashioned surname. What a spin on things. Don't they just look alike, such darling couples? After all, Putin can say a lot about them. <laughs> ah, George and Laura. Gotta love them. Gotta love Laura. Good old school teacher. Raising that Barbara and Jenna. <laughs> Take a good look. <laughs> Millie is never shown. <laughs> Mildred Pierce. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I love the first families. <laughs> what a dish, what a dish, what a dish. <laughs> now moving right on. <laughs> Where are we moving on to next? Good old Obama's. Barack and Michelle. Michelle Obama remind me of um, that girl from outside of Atlanta. Kenya. Mm. <laughs> Sorry, Kenya. <laughs> uh, but what if... You know, Michelle is a strong-looking woman. What if she uh, What if she had the sex change? <laughs> Those bangs. <laughs> that hard feature. <laughs> oh, Michelle, 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 <laughs> and Barack. Mm. Well, suppose it was just a imaging, a facial over uh, a, a, a camera lighting. <laughs> then what would we get from this lovely little couple? I adore them. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> mm. What if, darling? J. Edgar Hoover and the FBI, they have some massive secrets. Massive little secrets going on in that little building. And how they take care of these ruling families. <laughs> Dissension, they say, when they come on to Misa Mohammedina. I should be a little bit more organized tonight, you know what, you know. So many pictures, so many things to say. I can only do ten minutes of this, darling. Ten minutes of this. <laughs> The strong shoulders of Michelle, the softness of Barack. Mm. Here we get to the meat and potatoes now, girls. <laughs> ah. <laughs> what if <laughs> Barack Obama was really Condoleezza Rice? <laughs> really? <laughs> this lady did an interview once and said she just walks up in the White House. God knows why. <laughs> and that's it partner for Michelle <laughs> and this role played by another man this man <laughs> Colin Powell <laughs> we all know <laughs> we all know <laughs> we know that Alma is just a functioning wife a social wife <laughs> Colin has a free will <laughs> a roving officer <laughs> Some think he's sexy. <laughs> Some think he's don't. You don't know what the heck you're voting for these days. Just a representation and just an image. You don't know whose voice and a voice overlay. The FBI and the CIA such masterminds. <laughs> you remember at one point Dick Cheney shot George Bush. Mm. What does shooting mean? I'm thirsty Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> ah, still the presidential team in a time of war they hardly ever change presidents so they have to change faces darling <laughs> now let's get to the lovely Clintons <laughs> uh, Hillary is supposed to be the gem and the charm of that family and Bill the roving eye for women Oh my God, I didn't have a picture of the Clintons. Can you believe that? I can't believe I didn't have. <laughs> but Linda Tripp, <laughs> what a trip. This is really Monica Lewinsky with light here. <laughs> Nobody knows that. <laughs> and who does Paula Poundstone remind you of? Hmm? <laughs> she was really having an affair with Hillary. Nobody knows this. <laughs> That's okay. And what does Paula Stoneton look like? The number one queen in the army. Used to be the queen of Dubai. None other than... 
Peter Petraeus. Can you see the image? <laughs> Peter Petraeus and Paula Poundstone. <laughs> Two queens. <laughs> and sometimes what become of Hillary. <laughs> Another free life, Bill Gates. Because <laughs> we know... <laughs> Bill Clinton is always that glad. <laughs> well, we're glad they're gay. <laughs> Just own up and give the rest of us a chance to enjoy our life. This is Visa Grand Duchess. <laughs> my butt passage is wet, my breast is tender wet. Still, I would like the man of my dreams to ride me into the sunset. <laughs> Have a Dr. Pepper <laughs> day. Have a Dr. Pepper <laughs> day. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Have a good evening. Bye-bye.